Hey y'all, welcome back to another recipe. For today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to make brown buttered lemon pepper salmon. It's so good, it melts in your mouth, it is succulent, it's amazing. If you want to see the recipe, be sure to keep on watching. Subscribe if you are new here. Thumbs up the video if you find it helpful. Without further ado, let's make it. Alrighty, let's get started with the seasoning. I am using pepper. I'll be also using lemon pepper, which is why we call this recipe lemon pepper salmon. I'll be adding garlic powder. I'll be adding some salt as well. Be sure to check the description box for the measurement. I am making three servings of salmon. Once you're done cutting your filet, we're going to make sure we pat it dry with a napkin, remove any moisture. I'll be adding about one teaspoon of oil, just drizzle that all over the salmon just like this. By the way, I am using olive oil. You can also use butter or melted butter or any kind of oil that you have. We're going to gently rub our hands all over the salmon and then we'll be adding our seasoning on there. Generously add your seasoning all over your salmon just like that. Do not forget to add the seasoning on the side of the salmon because you want it to taste delicious on every bite. Once I am done, I am going to flip it over and season the back of it. On a hot skillet, I'll be adding three tablespoons of unsalted butter. Once my butter is nice and brown, we'll be adding our salmon to it. Once the butter gives you a nice brown color, just like this, then we'll be able to place the salmon on there. I am cooking the salmon skin side down on medium high heat. I will be cooking the skin side down for three minutes then I'll flip it over and cook it for another four minutes in total about seven minutes or until it's nice and firm and it's tender you can take it out okay my salmon are fairly small so they're not too big it might look big on camera but they're not that big this is it right here me flipping them over Now I am going to let it cook for another four minutes. Once your salmon has two minutes left remaining, go ahead and add half a lime juice in there. Also, you can add lemon juice as well. Just pour that in there and make sure you cook the side of your salmon as well. This is a thing for me. I like the side to have some type of crust to it. So this is why I cook the side. Once you are done, you have the most delicious, the most succulent, the most buttery salmon you'll ever taste it in your entire life it is so good with the lemon pepper flavor it gives you a kick of the sourness with the lime juice oh it's so good i hope you guys enjoy this recipe if you did let me know down below and also thumbs up the video for me because that helps me a lot you guys please let's get the video to 500 like subscribe if you are new here i do upload every day thank you for watching i'll see you guys on another video bye mm -hmm.